Dear Father in heaven, thank you for your many blessings and for keeping Johnny safe for the last 41 days, both physically and mentally, but also spiritually. And I just pray that this food would bless him and would nourish his body and that he would be restored in complete perfect health like only you are capable of doing. In Jesus' precious name, amen. Thank you for giving us the earth and water to grow whole foods, enabling us to nourish your body and minds with, providing us with life, a duty that is ours to adhere to, to not only preserve, protect, and sustain our miracle of life, but to also ensure that we fuel our body and minds with the healthiest of nutrients required for a full, vibrant life, free of disease. I want to thank my wife, my beautiful wife, for being part of my journey. And I'm going to explain to you how I'm breaking my 41 days of non-calorie causing no food for the last 41 days. And our ancestors, your ancestors, your first bloodline did not have a spoon. <laughs> so this is a, it's a very thick uh, broth. It's not a broth, but it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a soup, but it's a very nutrient dense, whole food, plant-based, organic, made with love by my beautiful wife, Liz. Um, soup that, it's how I'm breaking my fast. And I'm gonna take this, and as you can see, this is nutrient dense, this is plant-based, this is whole food, this is organic. And, salut, amour, dinero, que mon coeur au tien, à votre santé. This, ladies and gentlemen, Madame Monsieur, is so good. It's so good. She made me this today, like, anyways, like, I mean, <laughs> this is delicious. You know, a lot of people thought I, I'd be sitting here with a, a spoon in hand, and uh, like I said, I'm breaking my 41 days, no food, no calorie causing, um, fasted state right and they thought I'd be sitting here with a spoon in hand but I didn't like I was so prepared for this um, that to start uh, I actually took a shower took my time um, I haven't eaten for 41 days so what's the rush right <laughs> but it is scientifically proven that those that go in prayer that go at peace even bringing down your heart rate prior to a meal, you are a part of the top 10 longest, most vibrant living on earth. And this is knowledge that I've acquired over the last several years, knowledge that I adhere to. Hence why in the beginning, and I started this with that message, I asked my wife to pray beside me and I absorbed her prayer because I love and respect everything she's done for me throughout this whole process. She's been my anchor. And I told her, like I told those I love and respect, that I'm going on a 41 day fast, which I'll explain. But I was so disciplined and determined that I knew that I was gonna do the 41 day fast, that on October 31st, I entered that date into my fasting app, into my timer, and it was dated for today, December 11th, Monday, December 11th for 8.15 p.m. Right now, we're, what time is it? <laughs> uh, 8.50, okay, no rush, right? But I was so sure that I was gonna complete my 41 day fast because I was not alone in this. I knew it intrinsically. I told those that I love and respect that the journey that I was about to in, embark on, the path I was about to walk down, and I knew that I was not alone in this. The, the mental, physical, and spiritual challenges that I've been through in the last 41 days, moments where I found myself talking to myself, uh, exerting words that I won't repeat, 
um, finding myself so exhausted physically, not not tired because the entire time pretty much I insomnia. My probably average sleep is four or five hours as documented on my digital watch, digital timer, digital everything. Um, exhausted where I felt like I ran a marathon every day and I mentally, physically, and spiritually, like I mentioned, the challenge that I went through, but I was not alone. I am telling you, I am call it the mind's eye. There's a, I stripped this 1966 structure. I took it down to the core. I took it down to the foundation. I took it down to the frame. I went into autophagy mode. I went beyond the three day of fasting, which regenerates, regenerates your, your immune system. I went beyond the, 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 the structuring of the bones of the, the nervous system, the eyes, the brain. I went into the mind's eye. I sensed it. I felt it. I talked to it. I've been around it. Um, there was moments that my mind was very interesting. And it, it was a passage that, 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 I medically documented, I blood work, urine work every week documented, I documented the data, I did select supplements, nutraceutical supplements that I documented, I documented every fluid that went into me, every, again, nutraceutical select supplements that went into me, all documented, I wrote a book along the way that I'm still writing and I'm still continuing. Everything is documented. <laughs> um, and, and the soup's in front of me. And, and, and when I say I'm at peace, it wasn't about the food. I'm truly at peace without food. It's, again, what's the rush? <laughs> in 41 days, what's the rush? And this is so delicious. You have no idea how delicious this, this tasted like. Uh, but I'm so at peace without the food because it wasn't about the food. It was about the, the renovating of my body and mind, but not just for me, because it's my responsibility. It's your duty to you, to your body, to your life. The fact that you're alive is, is a gift in its health, right? It's like, what is it, 400 million chance to, to zero to ever being alive? And you have that gift of life? It's your duty to your life to make sure that you give it the life that it deserves, to feed it the nutrient density, to thank the earth, to thank, I, I don't want to get spiritual, but you know, God or the, the light or the energy or bigger than you around you. It's your duty to yourself, to your children, to those you love and respect, to those that love and respect you, to give it everything you can so that you live disease-free. You live the longest, most vibrant as possible, like I mentioned a moment ago. And that's why the, this journey, uh, it's a medical journey because it's beyond me. I documented everything and I, because I made it my duty to teach while I continuously learn. I made it my duty to humanity beyond me, beyond fighting my chronic illnesses, beyond fighting my high risk mutation of chronic lymphocytic leukemia, a fast like progressing cancer that I knew from data and research, my own studies, 10,000 plus hours in my mind, that I was, I know what I needed to do. I knew that from take my dyslexic mind and put everything together. And from all the data and research out there from around the world, from all the medical professionals, when you jump on the other side of the fence and you go to lifestyle integrative and holistic medicine, and you, you look into the, the, the research is sound peer reviewed that, that states that those that bring their body to the highest ketone body as possible and to the lowest glucose glutamine body as possible with the assistance of modern medication have the highest chance of beating cancer how do you do that how do you bring your body to the lowest glucose glutamine possible while living life by going into a 40 
day 40 night fast. That's how. The old books are right. Jesus, Pythagoras, Moses, they're right. The old books are right. You gotta go into that 40 day, 40 night to bring your body down to the lowest glucose and gluten your body as possible. And that's what I did. That's what I did to myself. That's what I did true to myself. That's what I restructured. I tore down this 1966 body down to the frame. And now I'm rebuilding. I've restructured, I've renovated, I've restored. And now beyond repairing, I'm rebuilding. And those that ask me, how are you gonna break your fast? I'm gonna break my fast for the next three days with this very delicious nutrient dense made with love whole food plant-based and i am going to continue living my pescatarian plant-based lifestyle i do not consume alcohol since february 2023 20, this year i do not inhale <laughs> i only consume whole food plant-based pescatarian lifestyle if it doesn't come from the seed meaning the earth and if it doesn't come from the seed meaning the water i'm not interested is there a process that i eat for example Bottled water is processed, right? Out of aluminum cans, bottled water is processed. Uh, Greek yogurts, yogurts, for example, plain fat free yogurts come processed. In a, in a pro but other than that, it's from the earth or from the seed or from the sea. So that's what I'm going to continue living with. And I started this lifestyle back on June 3rd, 2019, where I started with a 16 8. And from there, and I've talked about how I have lost 120 pounds back in the day four and a half years ago, and I never put the weight back on, and I only fluctuated 10 pounds in all those years. But if you look at my highest, most unhealthy of unhealthiest and heaviest, that was in 2019, I hit 363 pounds. And I'll show you the videos and, and digitals and the data and everything. I went all the way down. So on October 31st this year, when I started this 41 day fast, I started at 240 pounds, digitally, again, document and data. And my lowest was 198. So say 42 pounds. I lost 42 pounds between October 31st to December 11th, today, 2023. I lost those 42 pounds. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna start again at 16.8 because for the last four and a half years, I fluctuated uh, only 10 pounds, like I mentioned, I lost 120, actually 130, that kind of stuff, but that doesn't matter. I only fluctuated 10 pounds in all those years. I never put the weight back on and I got rid of medical condition, medical devices, some serious uh, uh, medication and medical devices that I got rid of. And, uh, but I started with 16 eights and that's how I told people, I didn't start with 41 days. I started with 16 eights, 16 hour windows of no food allows your body to repair, allows you the cleaning crew to go in and clean, right? So I'm gonna start again with that because I've, I've averaged 20 hours of fasting for the last four and a half years, and I did 24, 48, 72, 96 hours of fasting throughout those periods to build myself up to this 41 day that, again, I was put on this path. So I'm going into the 16 eights again, I'm gonna be eating three meals a day for all throughout December, into January, after my birthday of January 4th, probably on the 5th, I'm gonna go back to the OMAD, which is one meal a day, uh, breaking my fast with my supplements and raw nuts and seeds, and uh, my supplement shake that I've followed religiously since June 30, 2019, every single day. I've broken my fast with my supplements, with my exogenous ketone, with my shake that is filled with nutrient density, including raw nuts and seeds. And then I had one meal a day. That was my average for the last four and a half years. I'm gonna go back into that in January, but until then, three meals a day, pescatarian, plant-based, whole food. Um, and uh, my meals are probably gonna be consistent, approximately average 11 a.m., 2 p.m., 5 p.m. It'll fluctuate within an eight hour window, minimum 16 hours. I've never not, not done minimum of 16 hours of fasting since June 3rd, 2019. And I will continue to do so for the rest of my life. So that's my journey thus far. And I've said this before, and I'm gonna say it again. I did not cross a finish line. I went down a path that I was followed, I was, I, I was put on this path and I was followed all the way through. And I now crossed 
and I cut through the starting tape. I cut through a starting tape onto a new path of life that I promise you and I, that I made it my duty to teach while I continuously learn, not only for my betterment, for my health, and for the love and respect of my wife and daughters and my loved ones, but for the love and respect of humanity, for those suffering from chronic illnesses, from those suffering from diseases, from those suffering from cancer, from those suffering, from those that 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 are the predisposed and, 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 the, and the misfortunate. I will make it my duty to teach and my duty to help. Big, loving, healthy hugs for me to you. I love you. Thank you. Merci. Gracias. Grazie. Jean-Guy Bourguignon. Big, healthy, loving hugs.